Stable Diffusion is a tool to generate novel images by using TextSpront. If you, like me, have ever wanted to give it a shot, this is your chance. No need to install, everything runs in your browser and you can set it up in just a few minutes. In this video, I'm going to show you how I did it. Our first step is to head to GitHub and open the Stable Diffusion Web UI repository. Then we scroll down in the README and let's find the Google Collabs link. You can find it under installation and running. Just click on this link. Once open the link, you will be here in this Jupyter Notebook. Make sure that you log in with your Google account and then in order play all those command. This process should take few minutes. Go to the bathroom, take a coffee, and when you're back, the web UI should be ready. I'm going to fast forward this part. And here is the web UI. Notice that this link is going to expire in 72 hours. We can click on the link to open in a new tab to better visualize the content. Let's give it a first try. I'm going to write unicorn eating an ice cream. Yeah. Let's go with that. Go to generate and wait uh, for the progress bar to complete. If you click on generate again, it will generate another image totally different. Hey, uh, this one I think uh, looks better. I, I like this one. We can download it if we want. Or we can adjust the parameter to make it uh, different by using different samplings or other inputs. And then we don't have only text to image, we have also image to image extra like upscaling and other functionalities. For better results, you should use longer sentences. That's why we need to go creative. To get help with some idea, we can go to Mid Journey Community Showcase. And here we have uh, tons of images that uh, we can get few of the inputs. So just hover your mouse over those images and you can see we have those prompts that can give us few ideas of what we can create. For instance, I'm going to copy this text and go back to web UI where we paste it and we are going to add few more words to it. And here we have a beautiful landscape. So this is how you can set up and play with Stable Diffusion, text to image, I hope you enjoyed this video, subscribe for more and I'll see you in the next one.